congratulations on the film. It was it's so much fun. Uh, it it kind of really is a new a new genre, uh, multiversal romance. Can you tell me what initially uh, drew you to the script? Yeah, um, initially I I read the script and I I I love love stories, but I think what really drew me in was just how like the songs music was just so beautifully woven into to the this love story, and I yeah. I I don't remember I didn't remember seeing anything like that before mm -hmm. and also the idea of of playing a character like chloe um was fun and exciting to me i wanted to i wanted to laugh a little bit i think i, I was a little used to playing darker roles yeah, so yeah. this was a good breath of fresh air in hawaii <laughs> definitely um one kind of it's kind of funny but kind of also sad thing that is that uh, your character had it the worst out of everybody. Every time that the timeline had changed, her had life, <laughs> her life drastically died. changed. You know, <laughs> uh, uh, what, what was one thing or one timeline you wish the film explored more? Uh, a time. Well, you mean like a timeline? Like yeah, you know, like uh, there's you know? one timeline where her father and brother both died. There's one where she married the wrong guy. Like, which did you want more of the, those stories explored as far as like how far it affected your character? Um, I mean, it, it, it could have, but I, you know, I think the scene where I, 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 I talked to where Chloe talks to Laura about like, Hey, it, it's not just losing my, my brother and my dad that sucks it's it's that i don't even have my best friend to yeah, yeah. you know help me through this um i think you kind of see it in that moment what she's been put through mm -hmm. um yeah yeah so um and honestly a world without lewis pullman and matt walsh is just not a world that i want to be in so I mean, it's okay <laughs> we didn't get to see that too much yeah yeah <laughs> Definitely would have been a little bit of a downer. Yeah. Um, the film like uh, centers around music for sure. Uh, uh, the idea that music plays a huge part of your life and like that you can explore or travel back to a time where you experience that music for the first time. Was there a song that in there, was there a song in your life that you associate with, uh, you know, a, a pivotal situation in your life? Oh yeah. I have a few. Yeah. Um, yeah music works like that for me um personally for sure <laughs> i i have like a, a mitski song that brings me back to a very sad breakup mm -hmm. and nirvana is just like my whole high school experience yeah, um, yeah yeah i had a lot of feelings back then and i still do which is why i still listen to nirvana yeah. um so much <laughs> now another Another uh, character that's pretty big in this film and uh, kind of important is Hawaii. Um, yeah. It's a big character yeah. in the story. What did it bring to the film and was it hard filming in Hawaii? <laughs> was it hard filming in Hawaii? <laughs> yeah. I think, I think it would be um, a disservice to even say we were so lucky and honored to, yeah. to film there. Um, yeah. And I had, I had two and a half months there. Um, wow. And it was, I mean, I'm not like, I'm honored to be a part of this film in mm -hmm. any small way that I can be a part of it. But I I had a lot of off days too. And I was able to eat some really delicious food and travel around the island. And yeah, uh, no better place to nice. film a love story, I think. Um, really honored to be there for that. That's awesome. Now, was there a lot of collaboration with like the producers and, and directors as far as like where you wanted to what you wanted to do with your character? Um, I collaboration. I mean, I think I like going into it. I knew what, what I was uh, getting into, which is like just trying to bring good times, um, just trying to bring the fun and the lightness to um, the chaos of of uh, Harrison and Lo Laura's love story. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, and I was yeah, just really kind of excited to do that. And yeah, and I think Greg, the director, just kept pushing, like, just have fun, like, more fun, like, you know. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh, one thing that uh, I enjoyed also is that, uh, at least from what I can tell, the cast had a uh, really good chemistry was there a lot of like team building things going on or did you guys all just kind of gel well together from this from the get-go 
Um, it wasn't like, well, team, yeah, I mean, I think Greg maybe was doing that in his own way. I mean, he's also become such a great friend of mine through this process. Um, but he was very, he included me with everything, like since day one, since we were on the island prepping for the movie, Mm -hmm. um, you know, it could have just been Clara and Lewis hanging out because it is. Yeah, they're film. film. Um, but no, Greg had me you know, come be part of the party too. And and we, we went around the Island. We, we ate lunches and dinners and, mm-hmm. and went swimming in the pools and, and they, <laughs> Oh, Clara and Lewis, it was, it was so funny. I got to see them like training to get on the surfboard. Cause that's actually, they actually surf in this movie. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like that's actually Clara out there in the waves. That was insane. Um, but yeah, some, I, I don't, get to do that but i was there <laughs> watching them get on the board for the first time so that was fun that must have been fun that must have been fun yeah. now i mean there's a lot of things that you can take away with from the film like there's some messages and themes but what do you hope audience take away from this after they leave the theater um i i hope that they take away like the message of um yeah just really try to be present and enjoy every moment that you have with your loved ones because it's not a guarantee that you'll always have that forever I mean it's definitely not um and most of us aren't gonna probably be as lucky as Laura to get a a a cassette tape to help us travel back in time to see those people so yeah that's what I took from this film now the, the endings left a little open ended in in your mind what what happens after that dinner oh this is funny cuz when we were filming uh interesting fact there was like three alternate endings mm-hmm. to this film oh, and wow. we shot all of them and i don't i don't i'm going to let clara or lewis be the ones to like explain it cuz I don't know if it's like my right to explain what happens to this yeah, guy, yeah. but um, yeah, there's there's a few different endings. What was the question? I'm sorry, I just like got uh, what, in your in your uh, headspace. What what's their ending, or what did you want their ending to be? Right, their ending is they they kind of have a feeling like they've met somewhere before, but they can't put a finger on it. But mm-hmm. they like they date, man. <laughs> <laughs> I want those two to date. Awesome. Awesome. Now, my last question for you, it's, it's, it's a little bit off topic, but I think that I, it, I'd be uh, I'd be making a mistake if I couldn't ask. Um, I, I know you're reprising a role in the Midnight Suns and currently the MCU is trying to build the Midnight Suns. Would you be open to, you know, doing that as well? They're trying to build the Midnight Suns. Yeah, they got Moon Knight. They got Blade. Um, like for like a like a show or a feature uh, film or like I'm I'm hoping a TV or a movie. I don't know what their plan is, but they're they that's what better they're have me. <laughs> I'm, I'm awesome. I mean, like please, like ask. You know, that would be cool. <laughs> well, we'll yeah, put that we'll put that in the Twitterverse, and hopefully that you know so. that becomes a thing. Yeah, yeah, awesome. yeah. I had no hesitations saying yes to Midnight Suns, um, video game yeah. opportunities. So I will have no hesitations to say. Yes. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much for your time. Again, I, I really enjoy this film. It's like, you know, in a world where we get a bunch of reboots and sequels, it's nice for uh, new ideas and new stories to come out. And this is really fun. Like I said, multiversal romance. And I thought it's just a really, uh, really fun idea. And sorry that your character had to take the brunt of all the <laughs> all the changes, but uh, you did it. really well. <laughs> no, it's all good. No, thank you so much. Um, yeah, originality. Let's Let's do it. <laughs>